Hello, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to see the code for this problem. See that is press carries. Okay. So in this problem, we are given an array of integers a1, a2, an, and a number k. In one operation, we can do the following: that choose any index and set ai as ai plus one. Okay. So we need to find the minimum number of operations that needed to make the product of all numbers in the array. A1 to A1 divided by K. Okay, <clears throat> that is the case. So let's see. Like we have 2, 3, 4, and 5. Okay, that is the case. So, like if we encounter any even number, then our answer will be like we can easily divide by 2. So, and K is equal to 2, then answer will be 0. If k is equal to 2, suppose if this is the case k is equal to 3, then we need to find the number like how can we find like what we will do like we will do i, i is like b of i that is the number okay modulus this k and k minus. This is the case. Okay. So let's see some example for understanding. Then we will have, then we will discuss the solution. So let's go to the example section. Yeah. So in the first case, we have k is equal to five, and then we have number seven and three. Okay. So in this case, like we can make this number. We have to only increase that is the case so we will not consider this so if we increase this to 5 like that will need two operations first becomes 4 then becomes 5 and then if it becomes 5 that means it is divisible by the product will be divisible by this k okay so minimum number of operations will be required will be 2 so let's suppose another case that is 7 4 and 3 and we have 1 here okay uh, sorry k is equal to 3 so that means uh, 7 4 1 that is 1 and k is equal to 3 so what we can do like we can increase increment this 1 to 2 and the operations will be required with 2 here okay hope you understand this so the critical case will be like we can handle this thing like this if we will edit it through a loop and if the number if the number basically b of i if this b of i is divisible by k directly if this number is directly divisible by k that means our answer will be zero Okay, if this is not the case, then what we need to do? We need to do answer, we'll update our answer as minimum of minimum of answer previously, comma this k minus this number b of i. number b of i modulus k okay the minimum of answer comma k minus b of i modulus k that will be your answer and another thing you need to calculate if this b of i if this b of i is even if this is even, then we will do count plus plus. Okay. We will increase the count. Why it is needed? It is needed only in the case of 4. Like k is equal to 4 is the special case here. Why it is special? Like if we have two numbers that are even, if we multiply those, that will be that makes 
it divisible by 4. So like we don't need to perform any operations. Let's suppose in this case, uh, if you can consider this here, th there are no even numbers, although, but like if you consider this one, then answer will be here 3, but there are two numbers, like either you can increase like 2 or 2. If you make these 2 and 2 even numbers, so the product will be 4 and it makes it divisible by 4. So that is the problem here. So we can solve this by count. If that is the count, we will need to update our answer. Answer as minimum of answer comma 2 minus minimum of 2 comma count. why this is 2 like we can choose any two odd numbers and make it even and then the product will be divisible by 4 that is simple thing so let's see some code for better understanding let's remove this okay so here we need to take the input declare the vector and we will start taking input so if this i, i is the number divisible by k, then answer will be 0 directly. Else case, answer will be the minimum of answer comma k minus i modulus k. Okay. And if i modulus 2 is equal to 0, then count, we will increase the count. And this is the special case if k equal to equal to 4. That means we need to update our answer. So answer will be minimum of answer comma 2 minus minimum of 2 comma count. So like basically 2 is the extreme for k. Like if k is equal to equal to 4, that means we maximum, we maximum require 2 operations, not more than that. Okay, that is the case here. Hope you understand the solution. Like this video, subscribe the channel and thank you.